Okay, we're back. Day four. Good day, everybody. Mike here. Now, why would any gun guy ever want a spearhead? Because they're cool. It's not all about guns and hunting and shooting. It's just about sometimes having something that brings you a lot of pleasure owning. And I wanted a spear for a long, long time. When I lived on the prairies, I even bought, you know, I think it cost me about $60 for a, a bar of stainless steel that, uh, that I was originally going to make a spear out of. And when I moved here, I remember setting it aside in the corner of the garage for, for it to be the last thing I picked up. And unfortunately, I forgot it sitting right there in the garage where I put it. So a long time kind of went by and eventually I thought, you know, I'm just going to order one of these uh, spears, spearheads online. And I found this for, you know, a really good price. Cold steel, assegai. You know, it was a lot cheaper to buy just the spearhead and I'll come up with my own uh, handle or shaft for it. On here it says uh, 17 and 1 third inch length, SK5 medium carbon steel, 2 millimeter blade thickness. Now before I bought this I was really kind of worried that it was going to be, you know, flimsy and have a kind of a cheap feel to it compared to what I could make, you know, out of a solid bar of stainless steel. However, I was really pleasantly surprised when I opened that box and this is what I got. I mean, this thing probably only cost me, I think about $60. And uh, the sheath, not sure if it's Kydex or what kind of plastic it is. Uh, it holds the spearhead really securely. And when you, when you look at this thing, you know, close up, you realize that this is a, a hell of a weapon. Um, two millimeter thick steel is pretty substantial. I don't expect to bend this too easily. And uh, it's just got a wrapped, you know, a wrapped handle. But it does have a couple of holes here to uh, put some bolts through. You know, if you do want to attach it with bolts or screws, I'm probably going to drill them all the way through both sides. I guess you got to use screws. I did buy, I did actually buy a, uh, like a short shovel shaft. To put it on and it's just going to take a little bit of work taking the uh, the end here down a little bit and then I'm going to make this into a uh, like a walking staff kind of a thing uh, like I was mentioning the, sh the sheath on this is really really a great sheath I mean, a nice, nice, heavy, heavy, thick leather one would be nice as well, but, you know, this is well made, well put together, very secure, very safe when it's in the sheath, and a really good purchase. I'm really very happy with this. If, if you've ever had any kind of interest at all in having a spear or wanting to build a spear and you haven't gotten around to it yet, if you can get your hands on this one or the other model, the boar spear model, you're going to be very happy when you open that box. So that's it for day four on the five knives five days challenge my cold steel assegai spearhead have a great day everybody mike out